And depending on where you go, people just don't get it. The girls that get it, get it. Hi guys. Welcome back to another vlog, guys. It's Trine, aka Trine Jags. Oh, welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, hey girl. Today's Friday. Right now, I don't know what time it is. Um. All right, so it's 3.34 and I am, as you can see, done, excuse the bonnet, <laughs> but I curled my hair last night. Um, I was going to take pictures today or last night, but it got late and I just didn't feel like it anymore. So I'm actually about to do that now. Hopefully I can do that and I don't get interrupted um, where I'm going to take photos. So that's why my face is done. I'm debating about whether or not I should put on a lash. I actually think I'm going to take three pictures. So I'm just trying to figure out if I want to put on lashes or just mascara. I've kind of been liking my makeup with just mascara. I don't know. Even though I have absolutely no lashes, I do want to get lash extensions. But, but so that's what's going on right now. After I do my makeup, I'm going to go and take pictures. And then I think I'm going to head out because I have some errands I need to run. Like, I still am trying to get it together in here. Like, it's still so much stuff I need to do. So, I think I'm going to run to the store if it's not too late. I need to go to the grocery store. I need to find, like, a home goods, home scents, something. But step one of what needs to be done today is taking pictures. And then we're going to go from there. I'll show you guys what I'm what I decided to wear for our pictures. I hope that this outfit is cute because yeah, we, I hope it hit. I hope it hit. It's something that I put together, but I'm not I'm not making a lot of noise, you know? Cuz I need clothes like I don't have any clothes. My closet is not giving what it's supposed to give. So, yeah. Let me finish my makeup and I'll uh check back in once I'm done. all right so i combed out my hair it's a little frizzy in places because this is like an old silk press i just put clippings in here that's like my little trick for when i need my hair done but i don't have my hair done you know um i'm about to put on my outfit real quick this well, baby hair trick this is this girl that i follow on instagram she does hair like natural hair silk presses and stuff and like this is her little trademark i'm gonna link her account if y'all care but i thought it was so cute like i don't know and i was feeling the vibes okay so that's what we got going on over here but i'm about to change real quick um let me tell you the outfit that i thought i was going to take pictures in like like i told you i just wasn't sure if it was going to hit like that you know what i'm saying and it didn't but i spent probably like another maybe hour hour and a half i'm gonna say hour and a half trying to find something else to wear luckily i was able to find an outfit and if you're not following me make sure you go follow me on instagram you know follow your girl on instagram so y'all can see the looks um because she tries she tries to deliver the looks I just wanted to like let y'all know that's one of the things about being a content creator like people think it's so easy and it's like oh they ain't not doing nothing but taking pictures but like look no I like it's first of all I had to end up looking for something else to put on by the time I found the outfit I found somewhere to go and take the pictures because I, I went to one spot and the the background didn't go with the outfit so yeah I had to I took those pictures then like I'm had to go to another location take more pictures and um so yeah I had to um go get the little stain and set the phone on um yeah so then I had to go to another location and take more pictures um take the pictures find one that I like edit the photos post them on Instagram and then I just spent the last like 40 minutes on Instagram replying to comments because I do research a lot and I read or heard or something that um 
replying to comments or just like comments in general helps with your engagement and so if you're replying to comments right away within the first hour is like the peak time for your your post to get pushed out and if it responds well and gets high engagement like with the immediate following within that first hour then it gets pushed out to more people okay y'all probably bored with that but i said all that to say i just spent like the last 40 minutes replying to comments because i was trying to help get the engagement up for the photo so that took another 40 minutes okay so now we're talking 40 minutes to uh reply to comments which as far as i'm concerned that's an hour then it was probably like 30 minutes to take the picture the second time the first time it took like another 20 minutes so now that's a whole nother hour so now we're two hours in an hour and a half trying to find a new outfit um so now we're three and a half hours in and then the hour that is spent for me to do my hair and my makeup four and a half hours for one instagram post like it is just granted all the time the outfits don't necessarily um fail and you have to like start from scratch and find something else but like it still requires planning like you still have to go and plan an outfit unless you just got new stuff laying around you know what i mean but it's tough okay the fashion girls got it hard out here that's all i'm saying and i don't want anybody to think as a, or even just content creator period like People think it's a cakewalk, and it's by far not. Um, so now with a full-time job, I'm struggling. I don't know how the girls do it. And so it took me all that time to do that. I didn't even get to go anywhere or do any of the things that I wanted to do. I thought I was about to run errands and like all this stuff. No. Now it's 8.41. I'm hungry. Um, I was going to work out. That's not happening tonight. Like, who am I fooling? Nobody. I might work out tomorrow might i'm going to go get food right now and then i'm going to come home and take a hot bath and then probably maybe plan some content because i do want to record a video tomorrow but i need to like get a hold on exactly what i want to do i have is this it yes i have a full list here do you see this i don't want to like let y'all see exactly what it says because I don't want to spoil the surprises but i have literally a whole page full of video ideas right um, so let's hope that I scratched them all <laughs> off the list. But yeah, so that's that's the plan for the night. All the plans that we had are getting postponed to tomorrow. Um, and we got a long day tomorrow because I got a few things I need to do. So yeah, I guess I'll see y'all when I get in the car or like when I get to the place to go get food. Because I was going to DoorDash, but I'm going to just go pick it up. It's not that far. All right. BRB. All right. So, I mean, I look like I'm doing something, but I'm not. I just, I love this hair, actually. I need to get some more. Who would have ever known that I would be running around in furry bucket hats? Like, but I like them. I want to get some more. Um, If anybody is curious about where I got this hair, I'll link it below. But I don't know if it's still available because I got it a couple of, like, months ago. I think I got it back in, like, October, September, or something like that. But if I can find it, I'll link it. Um, But it's by the brand Fear, 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 Ruchi? Is that how you say that? Fire, Ruchi? Fear, I don't know. Again, <laughs> it'll be linked. Um, I'm buttoning it up because I'm on the East Coast and it actually snowed this morning. So, yeah, it's really cold outside. It's like 20 something degrees, like 29 or 30 degrees or something. Like, it's really cold. Um, so, I'm going to get my purse and. Yeah, we're we're gonna go. Oh, let me get my AirPods. Okay, phone, money's cool. Ah, uh, so you know I told y'all that it snowed this morning, right? All right, but just look look at this. Look at my car. This is my car. So where am I going? Cause I don't have anything to clean this off with. I was hoping that the snow would have melted by now from the sun. So, um, yeah. Going to get food is a dub at this point. Um, I'm going to have to order it because I can't clean off my car. I don't have anything to clean off my car with. Bro. And this is why being single is got out because if I had a man... He would have already made sure my car was clean. <sighs> okay, so the food is ordered. Um, in moving news, 
um, my bid finally came after three weeks. My bid is here. I need to put it together though because I didn't get the assembly and because I didn't want them in my room. Like, it's strangers. I just didn't want strange men in my room, you know, with me here by myself. So, I read a lot of the reviews. The bid came from Wayfair. I read a lot of reviews. Most of the people, said, like, all the reviews I read said that it was really easy to put together. So, I feel like I should be fine. The issue is, I don't own a screwdriver at this present moment or like any tools for that matter so i'm not i wanted to put it together tonight but that does not look like it's going to happen um so yeah tomorrow we're gonna have to buy some tools like a toolbox or some kind of tool starter kit do they even have that like I don't know, but I am going to probably just look at the instructions to see exactly what I need so I can make sure I get it tomorrow. Um, but yeah, other than that, I'm going to clean up some because I made a little bit of a mess trying to find an outfit. And um, wait till the full tier. Hey, you guys. Look what's here. Oh, I'm so excited that I can eat. My driver was so sweet. So shout out to her. Shout out to Allison. Hey girl, thanks for my food. Um, okay, so we're looking good. So I got, it's a grain bowl. You can see. I don't think any of my personal information is on here now. So I got a grain bowl. Let me take this off so, so you can see. it. Yes, okay, so it has falafel, lentils, roasted vegetables, corn, uh, olives, cucumber, and I got Greek vinaigrette dressing mixed with um, a lemon herb tahini, I think. And for anybody that doesn't know what tahini is, it's basically like a salad dressing made from hummus and like some other stuff, so. And then I also got a cookie because I don't know if y'all anything like me. When your girl eats something salty, she got to have something sweet and vice versa. Okay, you know, just to neutralize the palate. <laughs> you get me? This is not vegan friendly, but I mean, balance, okay? And then to drink, I got a Spindrift grapefruit flavor. So, I am about to devour this. <laughs> I'm going to eat. I'll see you guys later. Well, good afternoon. It's 12 11. Um, I am tired. I woke I'm not just waking up, but I did get up way later than I wanted to. I got up around like 10 something. I was watching Project Runway. Do y'all watch Project Runway? Like, it's still alive and thriving. And this season probably could arguably be one of like their best seasons. And um, it comes on Thursdays, but the, the most recent episode were um housewives that it was like they had to work with clients and their clients were housewives so that was like really fun to see i didn't work out this morning um so that's that on that so i'm about to like make a list because that helps me stay focused y'all i really honestly can get carried away in the stores and stuff so i have to make lists to keep me grounded <laughs> and on task um so I got my little notebook here and I'm about to make a list of the stuff that I need and the stores that I need to go to and like what I need from each store. Do y'all do this when y'all like running errands and stuff or y'all just like uh, freestyle it? Because you can't go to Target with just vibes. I know a lot of people do, but like I can't. I literally would be in there probably three hours. And then we'll get ready. I'm going to leave out at one. No later than one. So um, I guess I'll see y'all like when I get myself together so y'all tell me why it's 222 tell me why i said oh yeah one o'clock this is what i be talking about i don't know what it is with me and timing but she's not my friend okay so i'm about to oh also i left the list in the house the shopping list i do have the grocery list because that's on my phone Oh, I forgot to give y'all the outfit of the day. But I'm going to do that. I'm going to do that when I get in the store. Hopefully, I'll walk past that mirror. But, uh, 
I know I said I was gonna wear the pink sweatsuit. I decided not to because I really wasn't in the mood for everybody to be staring at me today. And I just know that, well, they probably gonna stare at me in this coat too. But in this outfit is gonna be more so like, oh, I like that coat. That's a nice coat versus girl who she thinks she is like you know i just don't live in that kind of city like if i was in atlanta or maybe new york or like something like that i feel like nobody would pay me any attention but because i live where i live it's like on the smaller city side and depending on where you go people just don't get it. the girls that get it get it and the girls that don't don't okay so um that's why i just put this on i'm gonna save that cute outfit to run errands enough at another time you know what i mean like when you want to run errands but you want to be cute so i'm gonna just save that uh but so anyway back to what i was saying i don't feel like going to home goods now because the home like i said there's no home goods close to me and i just don't have that kind of time to be taking like a trip like a day trip i would have needed to leave out way earlier so i'm just there's a tj max which is kind of like marshall's all of us the same there's one really close i'm just gonna go there and i'm gonna peek in target like i'm not trying to be in there in there Y'all, it's so empty in here. I thought the store was going out of business, but I did pick up a few things. So I got, I got this cutting board, um, which I also could probably use for charcuterie. But are you supposed to use a separate board for that? I don't know. Anyway, um, but I'm wondering if I should get it only because it doesn't have. You know how cutting boards normally have like grooves to keep the stuff from falling off, but it's a decent size, so I don't know. I think I'm gonna get it. I think I'm gonna keep it because I like that it doesn't have a name on it or anything. Um, and then I got this pan, which I thought was cute with the little wooden handle, and I like that it's gray and all that. So, all right, so far that's what we get. I really didn't want to get a cart because I feel like when you get a cart, you feel more inclined to fill it, to want to fill it. <laughs> but um yeah that's where we at this is cute i also need like stuff like this for like organization oh look here's a mirror all right let me get y'all a quick outfit of the day these are yeezy 380 i don't know the name 380 i think um this sweatsuit is from walmart y'all know i'm always wearing my jogger set from walmart this is the one with the hoodie um this coat is the coat from my moving vlog from misguided and this purse is from walmart too um which i thought was really cute i did a little uh reel for instagram uh walmart accessories on instagram and i did a short too i posted it on my youtube short so i'll post that link for the short to that so you can see the accessories from walmart but yeah i thought this was cute um and then this beanie hat is one of my friends has a clothing brand um i'll link his store also if you're interested in seeing what else he has but yeah this is this is the look so next stop is ikea next stop is ikea um I... see this why that's why i don't like them kind of stores because they be they be having like little stuff in there that you always be like oh i can get this i can get this i can get this and then before you know it yeah i can get then got you to a hundred and two hundred dollars like I wanted to get some um, hair products, but I was like, you know what? Let me not get carried away. or anything but like why is it that grown people got a problem with following rules you would expect that from children but not grown ass people i don't i just i don't understand it's like just put the mask on while you're in the store well i would rather you not even have the mask on if you're gonna walk around the store with the shit under your chin i just don't get it what is so bad about having the mask on while you're outside in public don't get it nobody wants to wear the shit nobody wants to wear a mask 
But at the end of the day, it is what it is right now. And part of the reason why we still have to wear them is because people don't be wearing them. <sighs> but I digress, cause you know, like, it's going to take a whole lot more for this than my rent, my current rent to help humanity, okay? Cause these Americans are ghetto. Oh, I forgot to tell y'all this. Why when I was in TJ Maxx? <laughs> when I was in TJ Maxx, this lady like walked up to me. She complimented my coat, which was fine. She asked me where I got it from. I told her, of course, cause you know, I'm that girl. I'm not that girl that's like gonna withhold the details. She was like, is that an online store? Cause it's from Misguided for those of you who don't know. But she was like, is that an online store? And I was like, yeah. She was like, oh, did you get your hat from there too? And I was like, no. And she was like, oh, okay. She was like, um, do you do a lot of shopping online? And I was like, yeah. And she was like, oh, well, do you know where I could possibly get and she whispered something. And I didn't hear her at first because obviously we in a store, it's the music going, and like we had masks on. So she was whispering and I'm like, I didn't know what she said at first. And then she said it again. She was like, do you know? Um, she was like, yeah, because I have a hard time finding good knockoffs. And I was, she was like, I mean, I'm trying to just find like a Louis Vuitton knockoff like work bag. <laughs> I was like, sis. That's not, I, I, I don't know nothing about that life. I don't know anything about the knockoff life. Like, I can't tell. I don't know. I was like, yeah, I don't, I'm sorry. I'm not sure. It probably just, what the AliExpress? Like, I don't, girl, I don't know. I'm, I'm a little bit insulted. Cause like, what about me makes you think that I know where they sell knockoffs? Knockoff Louis Vuitton at that lady. And no shade to the girls who wear knockoffs. Well, it is shade because I feel like, why are you wearing a knockoff? Just don't buy it. I understand we all want it, but it's other ways around things like that you can get designer stuff. It's ways around not having to pay full retail price for it. So like, no, but I feel like as a person who's into fashion, it's disrespectful to like wear knockoffs. Like legit knockoffs is disrespectful to the designers. And granted, some people might not care about the designers and not respect them just because, you know, capitalism and all that, which is fine. But at the same time, I'm about the artistry and the craft, you know? And I just feel like I can't respect the knockoff game, like the, the business of the knockoff. I can't respect that. A dupe, okay, because that's more like inspired by, which is great. That's like kind of like a compliment, you know? But a straight up knockoff, like, no. I ain't with that. But nevertheless, I thought that that was very funny that she whispered it. I was just like, what? Girl, at least if you gonna wear the knockoff, baby, wear it with pride. I mean, you know, stand on that. Y'all wear knockoffs? How y'all feel about knockoffs? Let me know in the comments. How you feel about knockoffs? Do you um, support knockoffs? Do you wear knockoffs? Is it a hard no? Um, does it depend on the the item? Like, let me know. All right, y'all. It's way later than the last time y'all saw me, but as you can see, I'm back home. All right, I'm about to get situated. Cause I literally just walked in the door, washed my hands and all that stuff. But now it's time for a haul, who's ready? All right, so we went to TJ Maxx. Well, first I'm gonna show y'all. We went to Ikea, right? This is what I got. This is what I got from Ikea. This is just like a little power drill set. They sell these. This was like $25. $24.99 or $95 or $90. $25 for this little power drill. It comes with a power drill. And these are like different color, I mean, different types of like uh, drill bits and the uh, charging cord and this is like if you want to drill holes and stuff so that's what this is we need this to put the bed together and also that's nice to have like you know just around the house for when you need to do stuff i don't know fix stuff i don't know i ain't here, i don't got a man child so i'm gonna be playing mrs fix it when i need to um So I also got from TJ Maxx, I also got this pan, this skillet, or what is this, a frying pan, a skillet? I mean, but a skillet is a frying pan, right? I don't know, y'all. So yeah, 
I thought that this was cute. I love the handle, how it's like this wooden type of situation. And then I like that it was gray and like it was the speckled gray. I thought that that was cute. So I wanna try to stick with this vibe for like my pots and pans and stuff. Um, Cause I feel like no matter where I go, as long as they're good quality, like they'll be able to go with me and kind of fit in with any decor pop, you know? Um, I don't know, they just look a little bit more modern to me. I like that. So yeah, non-stick skillet. And this was $19.99. So I'm excited about this actually. Like I love it, I think it's so cute. Um, so we have to wash her. Okay. And then from TJ Maxx, I also got this cutting board. I think I showed y'all this earlier though. So I like this cutting board because it wasn't, um, like it doesn't have any logo or anything on here. The only thing I don't like is normally cutting boards come with like a ridge around. If you've ever paid attention to a cutting board and I think that's to prevent anything from falling off of it. But I mean, whatever. Um, but this was $9.99. And this is from the brand Market Funds. I don't have to look them up. Also can use this for charcuterie because I haven't put one together yet, but I want to. So yeah, cute. Okay, I think you can use it for the same thing. Child, I really honestly don't know, honestly. But we're gonna, but we're gonna figure it out. Gotta wash her too. Um, this hat, this is like a camo um, moisture wicker wicking, is that what it's called? Yeah, microfiber moisture wicking running kit. Um, I liked the camo. I was trying to get like a few, but they didn't really have a lot that I liked. Um, that was this material. Cause I need, I want a hat to like, when I work out, I can just put it on, but you know, you sweat. And so this hat, I think is like, you know, it absorbs the water. Um, it was $7.99. So I got that. And I got a case for my AirPods because I don't know why, honestly, like this got me. You know those little things that be up at the front when you go into the register? Yeah, it got me. But I thought the color was cute and this is like super bright so that when you, when if it's like in your purse and you are looking for your AirPods, the color will like pop out at you. You can easily find them in your purse. So, um, and then I also got shower hooks. So I was looking for black shower hooks. Um, Cause right now I have in a uh, nickel brushed, like brushed nickel, which is the silver that doesn't look shiny silver. I had that raw, but I want to do, I was mentioning I wanted to do black accents in my bathroom. I don't know if y'all remember me saying that, but I was having a hard time finding black shower hooks that I liked. And I went in there to get a different kind of hooks for my shower curtain. Cause in the meantime, I'm gonna just do, um, these to go with the shower curtain rod that I have right now but eventually I want to change out the rod too so that the rod matches the hooks so I got the I picked these up um but then I was like oh these are cute because I didn't want that same shape like I wanted something that had so that you can actually see the black because my shower curtain is white and I'm probably going to keep a white shower curtain in, that, in my bathroom so I wanted like some black hooks that you'll actually be able to like see the contrast and I didn't want them to get lost you know on the shower curtain so I got these I like the shape of these um so when I get my black curtain rod my black shower curtain rod when I actually like do everything in the bathroom I will already have these so that was a good find and then um I got this hydrating shampoo from BioSilk I was I forgot to get the stuff so that I can make my hair treatment. I completely forgot, um, but it's okay. So I got this hydrating shampoo because I have a clarifying shampoo. I do want to get another one, but um, after clarifying shampoo, like I needed a hydrating shampoo. So that's, or like a moisturizing shampoo. So that's why I got, this is conditioner. Girl, never mind. Wow. Yo, I think I picked, this is conditioner. I did not want this. I wanted shampoo. 
I'm gonna wait. Maybe I'll exchange it. I don't know. Probably not, but we'll see. That is now I'm blown. I'm so mad. Have y'all ever done that before? I actually do this a lot. Like, think I'm buying shampoo when I'm really buying conditioner or vice versa. Like, girl, get it together. Read, sis. Read. That's all you gotta do. Also, broke my nail getting all the things out of the car. I mean, granted, it was time to do my nails over anyway. I thought that they were so cute. Look, the little evil eye. That chipped. Whatever. The dip powder that I've been using, I got it from Sally, the beauty supply store. It's not the best. Like, it's definitely not the best. I honestly feel like the one that's by, like, Sally Hansen that I was using way back, like, in the beginning of quarantine, I feel like that worked better than mostly all the ones I've tried. So, it's looking like I'm going to have to go ahead and splurge on, I can't think of the brand right now, but that's what it's looking like. But, yeah, it's time to do my nails again. I couldn't believe the whole thing broke. Like, are you serious? But I actually think I'm going to do them exactly like this because I thought that these nails were so cute. The little evil eye. Love that. Um, wow. So, I'm going to just keep this in here because I'm, I'm going to just keep this in here with the receipt because I might exchange that for the shampoo because, like, what? Or I might just get the shampoo. I don't know. That's We're going to figure that out at a, at a later time. I hate to get some wine y'all know while i was out so i got two bottles of wine i'm just like a red girl myself and it just kind of depends on what mood i'm in i like red but i also like white i drink red more but i like white i drink white more in the summer or like when it's warm my wines of choice when it comes to white is savion blanc for sure and Pinot Grigio, those are my top two. I'm a dry girl. If you don't, if you like sweet stuff, stay away from those that I just named because you're gonna hate them. Um, and then for reds, I like Malbec um, and I like Cab. So yeah, if you were ever curious. But, oh, and I also like Red Blend um, for red wines. Got the wine secured, because we gonna need that. What else did we get? Oh, I think that's all the, the fun stuff. So, as far as grocery haul, I'm actually about to put this on my airport case right now. Hold that thought. I gotta clean up in here. Like, it's a mess. But right now, I just be like, okay, if I clean up, where is everything going at? Because I don't have nothing organized. I really don't have a plan as to where anything is going at this present moment. So, it's just kind of like... That's what I really need to do. First of all, I'm indecisive. Okay, let's just call it what it is. I'm indecisive, AF. So me trying to figure out what color, what's this, what's, what's going to wear, girl, I don't know. And every time I try to sit down and think about it, I get overwhelmed, so then I don't do anything. Okay, um, that's the life I'm living right now. All right, look, how cute. Uh, Okay, wait see and this is why wait because why this side so close oh okay there you go <gasps> look i love it that's so cute isn't it that's cute i feel like that's cute like that's cute all right cool i'm tired now i just got finished eating my food because i was so hungry i don't really have any plans tomorrow i was supposed to be braiding uh, my friend's hair but because of the weather we don't want to risk it and like her coming out and having to drive or whatever. So it's supposed to do it like early in the morning. So we're going to like, you know, just reschedule her appointment. So, um, yeah, I don't, I probably just will talk to you guys in the morning.